Hi, welcome to the Cadiz Canada 8 Infinity Blessing. Let's talk about blessing today. And 8 is my cut off to make sure I need to go walking, going back home so I will not be late. 8? No, 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 late. Okay, let's start talking po. And let's explain it in Tagalog. <laughs> Why Tagalog? So it's easy for us to explain. Good news. Good news is because the other provinces here in Canada, they are willing to hire again employees from outside country. And of course, ibibida natin ang Pilipinas, mga Filipino. Guys, uh, we should be thankful sa mga naunang immigrants, so unang OFWs Filipino here in Canada, especially here in BC. Binibida ang mga Filipinos. And particularly here in Vancouver. Kaya madaming mga kapangpangan here. Kasi ang mga kapangpangan nag-iwan ng magandang legacy. Ano nga ba ang kagandahan kung nag-iwan tayo ng magandang legacy? As here, we're encouraging you again guys to apply going here in Canada. Siguro na may narinig kayo na may bayad. Yes, may bayad. Pero ang maganda dito, gagawan natin ng paraan. Nag-research kasi kami, dekada sa Canada, on how, you, how we can help you guys. Not only our friends, our families, not, and also our loved ones, but also to all of you, if you are watching these videos. Because we have lots more videos. So this is the first video. So first good news, nag-hire po sila ulit ng mga employees. Because sad uh, sad news is maraming mga na naging ayaw na na magtrabaho sa mga fast foods or restaurants dahil nga dun sa COVID na walang sila ng work. So gusto nila ngayon maghanap sila ng ibang work. Yung mga nandito na sa Canada. And para uh, front uh, frontliners kasi yun. So lagi silang naka, nakakamit ng mga iba't ibang tao, nagse-serve sa iba't ibang tao. So that's why bumaba na yung mga employment sa mga restaurants and mga fast food, more on food industries. But the good news there is nagkaroon na naman ng chance yung mga kagaya natin na gustong pumunta here in Canada. So I'm still remaining uh, two distance apart, uh, social distancing, right? And I started walking 6 o'clock and now it's 7.43, almost 8 o'clock. Okay, so we, we always look at the brighter side. Let's go back to our topic. Oh, ngayon, ang tanong naman, bakit kaya meron din silang naririnig na ayaw nang mag-hire ng Filipino sa mga ibang employers? Not all employers, guys. Nabanggit ko nga sa inyo, 8. Remind us the infinity blessings. Here in BC, especially Vancouver, mas gusto po nilang mag-hire ng mga Filipinos. Why? Kasi Filipinos po, hard workers po tayo. And magaling po tayong makisama sa mga kapwa Filipinos natin at saka ibang lahi. Kasi masiyahin po tayo eh. And we always work with love and with care. At saka madiskarte po tayo. Hindi tayo kagad na i-stress, umiiyak pag hindi natin nasolusyonan yung isang bagay. At saka may bayanihan pa rin tayong dinadala here. So we're still helping each other. Like kung masama yung pakiramdam ng isa is we are willing to cover them para at least hindi naman ma-delay or affected yung ating war. See that guys? Ang ganda doon. Oh. Smokies. It's like we are in Baguio City. Okay. <laughs> Pasensya na if I always 
say something in between ng ating discussion. Ayaw ko lang kasing mamiss yung beauty of life and I don't want na hindi nyo makikita yon. See? Punta tayo doon, ha? Oh, look at that, oh. See? Papakita ko sa inyo beauty of life. Look at the, look at the birds flying closer to us, guys. So it means they want us to embrace this great opportunity na pinag-uusapan natin. Okay, doon tayo. Mas maganda yung background doon. Or beautiful scenery while we're talking about our future here in Canada. Okay. Oh, ang ganda, no? Let's go closer there. And I'm gonna walk faster. And we will continue what we are discussing, guys. Okay, we're almost there. Yeah, that's the good news. Meron pa silang direct hiring here. What we're gonna do, guys, we're gonna give you the direct email address of the contact person in Mercant Agency. And we're gonna give you the direct contacts of the other employers that they're willing to hire more people here in Canada but that's really a good news guys they need more OFWs or immigrants from Canada and of course I from Philippines moved to Canada sorry I was distracted because of this beauty Let's cut this video and we will talk about again the part two. The part two is we will tell you on how we will embrace that good news. Hello, Bennies. That again, they are hiring here in Canada. Once again, guys, please don't forget to leave a comment and like and share. All bell, subscribe. The Karasa Canada. Bye bye. God bless.